Melbourne Rebels rugby player Amanaki Lalai Mafi has appeared in court, charged with assaulting teammate Lapetti Tamani. The alleged assault occurred after the visitors lost 43-37 to the Highlanders in Dunedin on Saturday. The 28-year-old was charged with intent to injure Tamani on July 15, which carries a maximum penalty of five years jail. Court documents showed his occupation as professional sportsman, with his address in central Melbourne. Maffey, represented by his lawyer Anne Stevens, appeared before Justice of the Peace Robert Montgomery in the Dunedin District Court on Monday morning. Stevens sought a remand without plea until August 3, with his next appearance being excused in a non-association with Tamani. Police did not oppose bail conditions. Maffey is set to fly out for Melbourne on Tuesday. Melbourne Rebels team director Tony Thorpe, the former All Blacks manager, was in court to support Maffey. Both Maffey and Thorpe declined to comment to media outside of court. Rugby Australia and the Melbourne Rebels said they were aware of an altercation between the two players, and confirmed Maffey remained in custody on Sunday night. They were unable to make further comment. A police spokeswoman told foxsports.com.au that a man has been charged with injuring with intent to injure following an alleged assault in South Dunedin. The alleged victim received moderate injuries following the incident. He did not require hospitalization. Maffey represented Tonga at the 2009 Under-20 World Cup in Japan, and after moving there for rugby was selected in the Japan national side by then-coach Eddie Jones in 2014. The powerful number eight played in the 2015 World Cup including Japan's memorable 34-32 upset of South Africa. He was signed by English club Bath, but left under a cloud in May 2016 after what the Bath Chronicle reported was an altercation with the club's head of sports medicine. Maffey signed with the Rebels in August 2016. Stuff promoted stories recommended by